Go to the game that I was at tonight, Perryton and Bushland for the Falcons homecoming game. They're getting rowdy from the beginning, but the Rangers get creative in the red zone. Quarterback Cooper Schilling says nothing to see here. Caden Rodriguez takes the snap, gets the ball to Gordo Estrada, who passes it back to Cooper Schilling. He takes it in. Perryton gets her first six on the board. Very next drive, the Falcons answer right back. Here's Quade Ferris showing off his arm deep field pass to Ty Purcell. He takes his defender with him for some extra yards. Touchdown, Bushland. The Falcons have a happy homecoming, winning this one 47 to 13. They are now 6 and 0. Well, we're gonna have Canadian taking on shallow water at home. It's gonna be we're gonna see him running out first. Opening drive of the game, Canadian's big time running back Slayton Dickinson takes the handoff. Spins, making two defenders miss and picks up some nice yards. Same drive, Weston Mitchell hits Julian Dominguez in stride, who takes it to the house for the 30-yard touchdown to make it 7-0 Wildcats. Canadian wouldn't be able to hold that momentum for long. They do lose big, 49-27. to And River Road on Groover's home turf tonight. First quarter we're going to go to. It's going to be quarterback Briggs Satterfield. He's got a sly pass, and it's so sly that even our camera gets lost. He's going to run out of frame for just a half a second, and he dodges the defender, finally gets knocked down. That play led to a touchdown for Groover. Later, Mustangs with the ball, but QB has Butterfingers too, and the ball is loose. Groover Satterfield dives for the call, and after some confusion, the Greyhounds get the ball back. Bottom of the quarter, Groover up 14 none. Satterfield again runs out to the side, finds him again, and the perfect touchdown, Groover. Groover's going to win this one all 56-14. to and let's take um, a look at some more scores. Stratford is going to beat Childress 21 to 14. Guyman with a big win over the Tulia Hornets 54 to 6. And some more scores. Slayton and Dimmit. Slayton puts up 57 against the Bobcats. And one of our Pick'em games, Farwell, beats Friona 39 to 13. Dalhart with a big win over Muleshoe, 50 to 21. And West Texas, 68 to 18 win over the Patton Springs Rangers. Well, those were some fantastic games. Alyssa mentioned Pickums. We've got that coming up, and we've got more coming up as well, Zach. So much great stuff going on. We've got two NFL superstars watching our show, Zach Thomas, Jason Witten. How yeah. exciting is that? I mean, as we all have known, I did not grow up a Cowboys fan. However, <laughs> I am a big-time Jason Witten fan because he coaches the same way he plays, ferocious. And you saw that tonight against West Plains. Yeah, I was on the sideline there. He was up and down the sideline, getting into it on the bench. Quarterback threw a pick in the first drive, and he was about six inches away from his face, screaming yeah. his lungs out. It was terrifying. <laughs> I don't envy that quarterback, uh, but he did get the win tonight. We'll be right back. We've got more wrap-up for you coming right up.